What's up, guys? Mark here. Welcome back to TASG, part of Season 21. Um, So, this is the first vlog I've done in the studio for a while, and uh, the main reason why we didn't do any studio shows in the last scene well, uh, was because of this. I don't have a table anymore. <laughs> so, today on the vlog... um, So, you know... A lot of my friends, um, a lot of my co-workers who watch the vlog and support the channel, thank you. Um, Y'all know that I love Mountain Dew Kickstart. It's been a go-to since my days in high school, 2016. 20, like, since basically throughout the vlog, throughout the run of the vlog, Mountain Dew Kickstart has been a staple. It has been a staple of me. Well, it was just, I think, just about a month ago now that uh, Jensen, one of our good friends of the channel, Jensen, uh, he told me to, uh, about this, Mountain Dew Rise. And guess what? It came in orange, too. So, aside from Mountain Dew Kickstart also appearing in uh, Taco Bell form as the orange drink from Taco Bell... Uh, there's another drink. It's Mountain Dew Rise. And I think there's also an orange version of Game Fuel that I tried looking for, but I couldn't find in my local area. But I need energy drinks to get me through work. All right? I work in an environment that requires me to be at a high amount of energy basically all day. And Mountain Dew Kickstart has been that go-to drink for me 80 calories per can and caffeine content 46 milligrams for eight fluid ounces 92 for 16 and i think on the rise it is 180 milligrams so it's this has double the caffeine but at the same time with 25 calories per can which is pretty damn good. So I'm like, you know what? Let's just go for a taste test. Let's see what happens. Maybe it would be good. Maybe it would be bad. I don't know. Let's see what happens. So this is Mountain Kickstart. Orange is my favorite one. I know they, they come in different colors. Uh, they, I think at one point they came out with the original flavor. So you could actually get Kickstart in the original Mountain Dew flavor. So this is Mountain Dew. And unfortunately, I so I bought both of these in bulk. Uh, they come in packs of 16 on Amazon for like 22 bucks. But I, uh, I usually buy a, a case of Kickstart a month and then just um, get, you know, get coffee the rest of the way. I'm pretty tired right now. So let's go ahead and take a drink. Familiar. The old standby. It is very juicy, so you, you'll you'll taste a lot of that of that syrupiness of it. It it's very, very orange and it's very good. So this is a five percent juice. I think this might be the same thing, five percent juice. Yeah, this is also five percent juice, but zero grams added sugar with zinc and vitamins. So this is more of a vitamin drink, but this is truly an actual morning drink, a good and a legit contender for orange juice. Now for Rise, I haven't really been able to test this a lot. Very interesting thing to note is that there, hold on, let me see, is there a warning here? There is not, surprisingly. There's a caffeine warning on the label. I don't know if it can catch it. Not recommended for children, pregnant women, or people sensitive to caffeine. This is a lot of caffeine in one bottle. In one can, rather. Um, 180 milligrams, which is almost double... Um, yeah, it is almost double, so it's 92 versus 180 milligrams of caffeine in this one. So this, theoretically, 
is is slash should be much better than Mountain Dew Kickstart and with less calories. Uh, all right, so let's head into rice. Ooh, added fizz right there. All right. Bottoms up. Tasteless. <laughs> and I'm not kidding. I, I really am not kidding. This is sort of tasteless. You can actually taste the orange in this one more than rice. It's very muted. The orange is there, but it's very muted. It's very low key. Um, immune support and mental boost. Whatever the hell that means. Buzzwords that a lot of these uh, soda companies do uh, as part of their marketing. Um, but in real world test, I've had a couple of these Rise Energies. Um, and they've really lasted me through like an, an entire eight hour shift. They're that good. Um, by the way, this was not a sponsored video. I don't take money from any companies. Um, interesting can. It's a very brushed aluminum versus the uh, shiny aluminum of the Mountain Dew Kickstart. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Zero added sugar zinc, vitamins A and D. Interesting lion as the logo. They also have multiple flavors. I believe they should be the same flavors that are available also for Mountain Dew Kickstart. That are also available for Mountain Dew Rise. The lower calories and the higher caffeine content is pretty much all I'm looking for right now in a good energy drink. And I think Mountain Dew Rise, see, so it just sounds like something that you would do for a proper nine to five. Nothing that like, um, you know, if you start or if you do like a night shift. Probably this isn't for you, um, but if you're starting out your day, you normally take a Red Bull or something. Mountain Dew Rise is better. Excuse me. Mountain Dew Rise is better than Kickstart. At least on paper. Flavor-wise, uh, Kickstart takes the cake, but Rise, man... Rice is good. Rice is good. Um, I get my Kickstart and Rice off of Amazon. I buy them in bulk. 16, I think either 12 or 16 count. And that tends to last me throughout the entire month. And then I switch over to hard coffee from Starbucks um, for the rest of the month and all that stuff. So... Yeah, that's Mountain Dew Rise. Um, get at your grocery store. I know the CVS across the street uh, from Disneyland. The CVS, and I don't think the Walgreens does, but yeah, I, I was able to find it in CVS uh, on the side of the Anaheim Convention Center. So that that's pretty cool. Um, so, so yeah, you can find it there. Find it at your supermarket. Find it on Amazon because that's where I get all my stuff. And yeah. That's going to do it for today, you guys. We'll be back 